Hello, welcome back to Disorientation. Uh, but I know where I am. I'm here at uh, Widow's Way, where we've been tasked by our friend, uh, our anonymous associate, to come and take this body off the gallows and uh, deliver it to the basement of the Old Bell Inn to the northwest. I guess mostly west. Um, so. Before we do that, I'm going to run up north a little. Actually, no, we're going to have to go through the Priory, aren't we? Don't see any way to... Uh, no way I'm carrying a body up over the canal through the warehouses. We can't get up by the river because the current's too strong. Um, so yeah, going through the Priory is probably the only way to go. So I'll want to scout out... I guess the road. this, this road goes here as well. Maybe that's the way to go. There were two swordsmen patrolling here, they were already knocked out in this corner. There's only our uh, keen-eyed archer friend there to worry about. Let's have a look around before we go grab the body of the gallows first. Let's see what these notices are. By the decree of the Lady Azamlar, Warden of Dark Smoke, let it be known that no man or woman, nor any child of outside residence, is to set foot on the streets of Dark Smoke after the 11th toll and before Cox's crew. Unless by the lady's personal consent, those who are in violation of her ladyship's orders shall taste the whip. By the decree of the Lady Asimlar, Warden of Dark Smoke, let it be known that the trial of the infamous plant is set for the second toll of Morn's Day on the 10th of Recidivus in the year 832. The miscreant is to be judged by her ladyship and thereafter delivered to whichever fate she selects. Afterwards, the honest folk of Dark Smoke may approach her ladyship and ask for justice in their miscellaneous squabbles, etc as it is customary. The beggars of Dark Smoke, if in possession of a letter of arms, are permitted to attend if they ply their ancient trade with the appropriate discretion. By the decree of the Lady Asimlar, Warden of Dark Smoke, let it be known that her ladyship and her guards are on the lookout for the thief Garrett, formerly known by the false names of Talbot, Messer Johannes, Philby, and no doubt numerous others. Garrett is of nondescript appearance, below average in height, and fond of dull grey clothing. He is wanted for the murder of a wealthy patrician in Downlock District, participation in pagan conspiracy, the subversion of public order, and several counts of theft. The Lady Asimlag offers 400 pieces of gold to whoever would bring her definite proof of this miscreant's demise, or 100 pieces of gold for accurate information of his whereabouts. Let it also be known that whosoever aids or shelters this devious fugitive shall perish like a criminal. Only 400 gold, huh? Oh, there's our archer friend. Don't want to run across him. Hope he doesn't come this way. I'll find a dark corner just in case. Oh, he does come this way. Actually, now that I've got a dark corner, actually, maybe that's good. I can actually knock him on the head. Only 400 pieces of gold. Uh, for me, you like. Oh, wait. Another, another friend. I don't think I can take on two at once with just a blackjack. Oops, it's a bit bright. What are you carrying there? Ah, oh, he's, he's got a bow and arrow too. Oh look, he's guarding the gallows. 400 pieces of gold, that's like a uh, very poor knight's pickings for old Garrett. Come on you. You will not trouble me anymore. I'm going to take you and leave you here. Yeah. I need to know the, know the other guards there. Is that a switch? Nope. Before I worry about that, what's the chest? Uh, broadheads, okay. Uh, let's just see if there's anything down this path. No, that just connects back to the canal here. That's the canal, yep. Yeah. Um, the street runs up to the north there. And should let, let us go through. Alright. So before I take the guy down, which I think that's probably the quickest way to get across, I'm going to just try and scout out the back of the Priory here, where that other guard-looking fellow in red was. Can't hear him coming. Um, let's see if there's anything of value that I can liberate from its, you know... Unrightful owners. Do these doors open? No. Oh, here he comes. 
Find some darkness. Do I let him live? I don't know. I'm kind of inclined to, but I already run into. I'm out of flash bombs. I'm out of healing potions. I've run into too many guards already. I mean, I let him lay up short, but I think I might make him sleep. I take his money. That's all right. You'll wake up in the morning. You'll have a slight headache. You won't be able to account for anything that's happened. But it'll be fine. There. Come on, open up. Come on. Into the face, as always. Oh. Where does this go? Straight up. Huh? Um. I mean, that's not even a door there. That's a fake door. Is there something else here? Apparently not. It is just a ladder leading to a place that goes nowhere. Alright. Well, that's a bit of a cruel joke. Right, here's the priory. Give gifts generously for the builder's plan! I think not. Oh, doors not opening. Oh, I've been here before. This is where we're looking from the canal, and this fellow wanders back and forth to various uh, doors, does he not? I oh, know we're up there looking down and heard him walking around. Okay, I don't think there's going to be anything of value here. There's no doors there that I can open, so I'm not going to bother trying to find out. Back to the Widow's Way. And to our friend, Mr. I don't even remember his name. What's your name? Where's my note? My note tells you the, the name. Where is it? Instructions. Uh, Issen, the exchanger. Come on, Issen. You come with me. We're going to have lots of fun adventures together. And make sure nobody sees me carrying you down the street. pretty bright and I haven't actually scouted there at all. <coughs> Should probably take a look. Seems clear. Uh, yep. Listen, why are you so fat and heavy? Uh, actually, while there's no one in sight, I'm gonna go across this metal bridge. I'll just dump you in the dark there. What's in this doorway? I don't know. I'm gonna find out. Come on. There. There are no guards out there. Now that I've uh, knocked out the ones that were patrolling up and down here. Oh, another ladder up. Is this one also just a dead end? It's just these little guard stations or something. Out behind the statue. This is very, <laughs> very reminiscent of uh, that uh, courtyard in Bad Decks that was uh, had secret passages behind the statues. Well, not secret, but high up passages. Ooh, where does this go? To the north in pitch darkness. Well, it comes out above the waterfall. So if I wanted to swim again, I certainly could do so. But uh, I don't really have a need to swim right now. I'm not sure why I have a way of swimming from there when I could just as easily swim from almost anywhere else. And what? Does this not open? What? I don't see any switches. But. I could just jump in from here, I'm not sure why I need to jump in from there. But if I look there, there's another statue that I could jump across to. So it's all pointless again. Alright. Unless I'm missing something. Yeah. 
down the ladder, go. Not, not. Down, down. Without falling. Alright. That seems a little less pointful than I was hoping. Alright, where's our dead friend? Seems pretty quiet on these streets. Oh, there's a notice. What does it say? This building is condemned. Do not attempt to enter. I mean, see, I could enter by jumping across from that section to the other, but it doesn't seem to be an actual way to go. And now I want to enter this building. You've made me nerve. You made me curious. I don't see any way in. Just keep going. That's oh, I've been up there. Which means. Oh, there's a guard. Hard to know less, so let's make sure the bodies. Yeah, just rats. Does he come this way? Yeah, he does. Alright, I'll wait for him to go back. Unless, of course, he comes all the way around here and sees the body and gets excited, that would be inconvenient. Just don't look to your left. Don't look to your left. That's right. Just just pay no attention to the body in the corner. It's one you already killed yourself, you know, you dealt with yourself. Pay no attention to the man with the blackjack either. Alrighty, come and hide in this dark patch of street. You didn't have any money on you, did you? Nah. Already one less problem. Come on. Oh yeah. Come with me for a nice walk, Mr. Isin. Is this door open? Nope. Oh. Well, alright. You wait there. I'm gonna go scare ahead to make sure it's safe for you. Garrett can get away. Hurry. Very drunk out there. Oh, it's not a guard, just a, just a drunk man. Alright, there is someone in the inn. And I need to find the cellar. So here we are at the old bell. Uh, there's a little buddy here, so we go around this side where this fellow is. He won't cause me any trouble, right? He's not going to mind. Uh, some sketchy looking fellow carrying a body down the street. I'll just tell him, if he, if he asks me any questions, I'll just tell him that this is my friend who's drunk. And uh, I'm just taking him home. Yeah, he's very drunk. So you don't mind me. He doesn't care at all. I'll check that out in a minute. Alright. Guards. Nope. Alright, we've got a door. I'm guessing that's the <coughs> cellar door. I'm hearing somebody walking around. I don't know where. I've been here. Oh, that's locked. I don't have a key for that, do I? Oh, I've got this old TARDIS key. What? What was that looked for? That was the... Crumped up letter? No. Scrap of paper. Found in the canal was that key. But I not found a door near the canal that I couldn't open. Um. Hmm. Well, let's double check the instructions of where I need to deliver this fellow to. On here. Blah blah blah, carry him to the cellar of the Old Bell Tavern. Uh, unlikely the bartender and bouncers will be happy to see you. Lay him down to sleep in a conspicuous location in the cellar. Alright, that's the cellar door. I'm gonna need to find a way in. No, no trespassing upon the lady Asimlag's orders. Deliver messages and supplies to upper entrance. Oh. Well, I mean, I've got a quite a dead message here to deliver. 
Ooh, there's guards. What? Where did all these guards suddenly appear from? It was deserted before. Let's get to the shadows. your problem. Go on, sleep it off. You're trying to punch me? It's not going to end well for you. <laughs> He's still got his bottle attached, look at that. Just floating that in the air there. Alright. Well, as a missed script, I should have made him drop the bottle when he knocked his knockout. Here did say Tenor drive the spike into the rock and preach the sermon of the master builder to the thief. Well, not to this thief. Alright, so, what's this place? No, 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 don't fall. Oh! Wait, did I... Is this the same... Is that a door I couldn't open from the other side, or did I just not see this door? Because this looks like where I came in before. Well, coming from the warehouses. Oh no, I looked out this way, saw the bridge, saw the streets, and thought, I don't want to go out on the streets. I didn't realize that that was back way from the old steel mill straight to Turner's Plaza there. Alright. So what I don't know is how I'm going to get into the cellar of this place, I guess. Well, not through the front. Oh. Uh, I was going to say, not through the front door. But also, not while well, I... Uh, while an archer's running around looking for me. Oh, he won't find me here. I hope. Just keep an ear open. Yeah, just rats. It's always just rats. Well, I'm not sure I like you and your pretty fly things, so if I can haven't lost my entire skill as a blackjack, I'm gonna knock you out too. Oh, it's dark there, you can stay there. Alright, how do I get in to the cellar of the inn? No, you saw nothing. There's an upper entrance. Ah, oh, the upper entrance is up here. I see a wooden beam as well. <laughs> oh, beer garden. What? Are you dead? Soon after the golden glow of my happiness did envelop my heart, and foolhardy hopes cloud the vision once impeccable, did I lose all that was worth having. How is it then that joy is but a fleeting glimpse soon borne away on the wings of disaster? How is it that hopes flee before dark feathers, the bitter omen of things to come? Yet never did I think the glittering treasures would vanish in the thin air, as surely as he who was to be mine did depart with another. Fate's cruel caress it is, and yet a final deed is now to be done, closure to this existence of unfulfillment. Now do I cast this unhappy journal out of my window, and with it a worthless life. The last sip of the wines I enjoyed, so will aid me to sweeten the final downfall. I am. I'm very dead. I jumped out of a window up there. Right, well, there's a couple of crates. Not that I really need the crates. So, oh, actually, with those crates, I might be able to make that jump up on there, but that's not really my plan. I could climb up on that ledge and break a window as well. I'm just thinking, let's go for the old rope arrow in the wooden beam trick. And there's 
someone out there who looks armed. Yeah. Let's wait for them to move on. Come on. Stop. There we go. There we go. All right. Let's try this again. God, you guys get some better music, didn't you? All right. Uh, that chain doesn't take me anywhere useful. I might just leave the rope for the moment. I don't know if we're going to need it coming back down. Oh, the bottle was actually worth something. It doesn't look like it was. It's a very watery curtain. Uh, that doesn't take me anywhere. I could jump on the roof and slide down to my death. That doesn't really help me. Although, the arrow, although I've left the rope arrow there, I'm not sure it's actually going to help me get back down. Oh, can I come up there? Yeah. Oh, Some people have been playing cards and leaving their money on the table. Wine stained scroll. In honor of the Lady Asimlag and her most salubrious wines, which the most honorable Benjamin saw fit to provide for this very purpose, we hereby establish the Society of the Tower and the Bell, as of the year 832, month recidivist, day the third, on this pleasant terrace above the teeming streets of our lovely city. May whoever hold rank in this hallowed cadre carry himself with pride and distinction, protect the honor of Our Lady even in the face of adversity, and drink of the essences as it is appropriate for a gentleman of elevated station. Absolute secrecy is hereby sworn to confound the knaves and villains who would bring us harm. Of this we swear, the most honorable Delvins, Grandmaster of the Chiming Bell, the most honorable Mongrave, Knight of Viands and Essences, the most honorable Benjamin, Exalted Guardian, the most honourable Tortoise, he of the Mop and Pail. The most honourable Gradvolt, Furnace Feeder and Lord Transportator. Penned by the most honourable Tortoise on behalf of the Society. Oh, well, alright. All right. The Secret Society is uh, not really going to do them any good. Can I climb on that? I can't climb on that roof. Such a tempting roof. Uh, I don't think the ladder actually takes me anywhere. Useful. Uh, except to so old. Oh, this can I get? Can I climb even further up? That's a good question. Looks a little high there. I had those crates maybe, but without them, seems doubtful. And that's not a door that opens, is it? No. Okay. So how did they get onto the terrace? I guess they can open the doors, and poor Garrett can't. All right. Can poor Garrett get back down without uh, injuring himself to death? Yes. More importantly, can he get back down here without injuring himself to death? I guess that's why there's a chain there, so I can hopefully jump from the chain onto my rope. Oh, there's our archer friend. I don't want to don't particularly want him to see me here. Just see his bow there. Just wait for him to turn away and go back inside. There he goes. Alright, let's try this. Acrobatics. Now, unfortunately, I'm going to have to leave my repair there because there's no way that I can safely get off it. Come on, Garrett. Put the wall. No, that's too, no way I can make that jump. I don't think even with the crates. That one I should be able to make. But, uh... Carrot's a little out of uh, sorts today. There we are. Oh, it opens. It doesn't have to smash it. Perfect. Smashing windows tends to bring... unwanted noise. Where is our archer friend? Because that's the way he patrols. I'm a little nervous about being out here. I also see some loot. But I'm not sure I want to get it just yet. I don't know how I get there. There's a wooden beam, but it doesn't help me get 
to there, only from there. Like a speed potion. Jump. Why not? I've got a speed potion, I very rarely use it for anything else. Here we go. Yay. Ow! Not so yay. Our archer friend has seen us. God damn it. Nope. Ah. Come on, stop shooting at me. I'm trying to escape. Oh dear. Well, he's, uh, unfortunately he's uh, a better shot than I'd like because he got me quite badly there. But uh, not quite as uh, good a shot as he would hope. Oh, right, there you go. That'll teach me to be foolhardy and go chasing after loot while enemies are running around with uh, ranged weapons. I don't think I want to get back there, because you've got sharp things and they hurt. Is there someone coming here? No, it sounds like he's gone back to patrolling. Alright, I don't know how I get down from here. Not this way, that's for sure. Alright. This way, all right. Let's do it. Okay. So where does this fellow patrol to? Because he clearly doesn't go over there. And I guess that's a way I could have got the uh, loot without the speed potion. But never mind. It was a good jump. Ah, I'll teach you. To shoot me in the back? Or was it the face? I can't remember. You can come and sleep here and don't roll in your sleep or you might regret it. Um, however, I came up here to try and find a way into the cellar of the inn. I definitely don't seem to be any closer to the inn at all. I seem to be further away if anything. Oh, this is the backyard of the inn. Okay, so we're above it. Well, Alright, maybe there's another door. That's not a door. Maybe there's a way in here? Nope. Hmm. What is that? Oh, the, is that the palace? Yeah, yeah, that's the palace grounds to the north. Alright, well, good to know. The palace will be useful, but that's not really where I need to be right now. Uh, that explains the uh, armed guards, anyway. The inn wouldn't be able to afford those, but uh, I'm surprised that with this bloody music playing constantly that uh, the palace people haven't uh, complained. Is that a door that opens? No. Now he's got his spare bow up on the wall. Is that open? No. Oh! More broadheads, but I can only grab it once. It's weird, it doesn't disappear. Alright, well, there's our rope again, but I can't get back. So my attempt to find a back way of the inn was not very successful. We've had other successes in terms of loot, but uh, not anything I needed. Oh, more guards. Anyway, that takes me further from the inn. Um, so that was not a way into the inn that I thought it was. That window. So... I guess... I'm gonna waltz in the front door? Is there anyone in there apart from the bartender? The sneezing bartender. Yes. There's another set of footsteps. Huh. 
to God. Poor thief. He's pretty twitchy. before he has a chance to use his sword on me, which I would not appreciate. Banner! Oh, it doesn't drop. What's the notice say? No credit. Well. That's alright, you don't have any money, do you? No. No, no cash behind the bar. Hmm. Oops. I'm not sure if the prank works if uh, everyone in the bar is unconscious, but you know. Alright, that looks like it goes down to the basement. That's where I will need to go. What's down this way? We have... The music seems to be coming from the fireplace, okay. We have some uh, sausages. I'll eat them, but they're not... Let's see if any of this gives me any hit points back. Hey, one hit point, alright. So, so much for that. Better than nothing, but not by a great deal. Alright, a uh, rather damp place to sleep by the looks of things, but... Oh, wait. Alright, that's just the basement. Alright, that's where we need to drop him, so let's go get our corpsey friend. Uh, who's around this way. Although, it says to little body here. Oh, I was pointing to the inn, not to the back alley, okay. I thought they meant the back alley before, and that's why I was... No, not you. Um, and that's why I was uh, coming up this way in the first place, because I thought there must be a back entrance. There is that door there, that's locked to the key, but that might... Maybe that goes to the palace, and not... To the um, thing with you, not to the basement, not to the cellar of the inn. Alright. Come on, in, Sin. So, yeah, I don't know how you'd do this without uh, everybody alerting everybody. I saw some rafters that don't quite touch the roof. It's odd to have these rafters everywhere that aren't supporting anything. It's. Oh, that's right. Looks good. Well, it is a nice conspicuous spot to leave him, right? If he goes in. Does that count? Uh, oh, it's because it's not an objective, so it's not going to tell me. What's the instructions? Uh, blah, blah. Blah, blah. Meet me at the statue of Sit Turner next to the tavern and I'll have the key ready. Alright, you better have that key. You better have that key, man. No. Not at the statue. Maybe this spot isn't conspicuous enough for you? How about the bed? Put him to sleep, you said. You know, lay him down to sleep. Alright, so I'll put him on the bed. Come on. Get up. I'm on the bed. Let's. I think I deserve a pat on the back for that one. Well, or at least a key. Good work, out. So where is our mysterious friend? Oh, he just left the key there. I don't know, a message. Well done, well done, thief. I'm sure you understand why I didn't hang around to see you in person. This is not that night. Still a bargain is a bargain, and here's the key you've been looking for. Coincidentally, the door is right there in the alley to the right, and it leads straight to the palace grounds. I hope you have rope ready, but in the unlike unlikely event you have none, you may want to visit a small shop close to the gallows. I've heard they might keep that sort of merchandise. Well, indeed they do keep that sort of merchandise, and I have already been there and stolen it. But rather than take your advice of the back way in... Uh, oh yeah, that's, that's where I put it, that's where I went. Rather than take your advice of the back way in from the alley, I'm going to try the gateway that I found up here. Because I've already wasted a rope. Might as well make it useful. Well, I guess it's not the rope being useful now, it's just <laughs> decorations. 
thought I'd explore this way and uh, waste a speed potion getting over there, but it was fun, so it's not really a waste. And we have a gate this way that probably leads to the palace as well. Where's that key? Not that one. This one. Aha! Here we are, inside at last. Oh no. Can I pick this one? Nope. What does that do? Oh, I see. It's just like it. This one I can't pick. And my key doesn't work on it. Alright. I guess I'm not going this way. So much for that. So much for trying to be clever. And back we go. Go to the alley then. Why does the palace have a little back door? Onto the alley that's not even guarded, it seems very poor security. But alright, whatever. Drop onto the crates again. That's right, they won't crack, they won't break just yet. And there we go. Now, I don't even remember why we're going to the palace anymore, it's been so long. Uh, we're going to go to steal Lady Azimlarg's scepter, that's right, to give her. Some uh, basically send her a message. Right, where's that key? Key, key, key. There we are. Where does this take us? Another corpse. There's a lot of corpses lying around in random places in this mission. So let's leave the door open. I might need to get out that way. Hmm. Oh, there's a guard in there, but he's not a problem for me just yet. So that odd little courtyard. I guess up there is where is that terrace where our friends were. But that was the the ladder let me look over here, but not actually get in here. Oh, what arrows? I don't mind if I do. Nice, that's a uh, fifty percent increase in water arrow uh, inventory. Oh, hello! I know where this is. Would you look at that? This gate. Oh, it does open with the palace gate? Why didn't it open before? Ah! Alright, whatever. Well, this one would better be pickable. Oh, we're kind of screwed. No. No. Come on, where's the, where's the key? Palace key. No. What? I guess that's why I said we better have rope ready. I guess I'm missing a place to use my rope. Which would it actually be right there at that window? Oh, I didn't see it before. So, right, the key wasn't to the palace then, really. It was kind of this palace crypt area. Is there any darkness here? There is. Oops. Noisy darkness. Statues. Small bread. I wouldn't mind having that. Let's be quick about it. Come on. Pick up the... Can't pick up the bread. Well, that's just rude. Oh, he's coming back. Or maybe not. That's noisy. I don't have a single moss arrow. Should have waited there where it was quiet to knock him on the head. Oh well. Oh, her. Uh. Hey, you. Yep. No, I don't feel like stopping. Whoops. 
Oh. Ouch. You wanna follow me? Ow. That's not what I meant to do. She does wanna follow me. And she's fast on her feet. And I think she locked the door behind her here. Which will be a problem for me. Oh no, that door. Alright. Uh, I have an escape route. I can jump. Run away. I'm out of flash bombs, so I don't really have many other options but to run. I'm not so sure that you do. She can't see me here, that's good. Turn around, go back. I'm not here. Come out and fight me. My baby brother does better than that. Oh, you get back. Oh. Ow. Ow. <sighs> ah. Oh. Karen's gonna kill himself just uh, with the acrobatics here. Nope! Oh wow, managed not to take any damage that time. But uh, it's kinda dangerous. Alright, I think I need to give her a little more time to calm down. Show me again. Why is she going and waiting there? <sighs> Alright, I guess I need to be a bit more patient and uh, regret not having a little more in the way of health. I don't need to hide forever. Just long enough. Hello, can you see? She didn't even see me here. Come out and fight me. Whoops. Ha! I'll see your bones bleach yet. Over here! <sighs> no, that didn't work. Garrett, stop jumping the gun. Even here right now. Yeah, she's in a favorite hiding spot there. God, that music. <laughs> Coming there to search. Don't think you'll escape. Well, I already have several times. You get back here right now. Intruder, to me. She's running away. Back to the nice observation corner. All right, maybe then, when she's gone that way, I should go the other way and uh, back round through the long way. The way that I went in. While she's yelling out for help, there's nobody around to help. Oh dear, I desperately need more healing now. That was terrible. Terrible, terrible, terrible. But, at least another way in and the way out.
Come up here. Tell you what I should do. Mess up an escape route there. Just in case. Oh, she didn't see me. Alrighty. Are you the uh, judge that uh, we're not supposed to... Could have unlocked the door for me, couldn't you? Alright, you Lady Al... Algebra. Lady Algebra, why are you wait here? Alright, I guess I'm going in the uh, back door again. The rope. Well, there's still guards about, okay. Alright. What the hell should be in here? I really can't take this bread, can I? Oh, those are valuable though. I'll take them. Missed them before because I was kind of in a hurry. Alright, uh, what have we got here? It's just the whole of your palace. There's a door that I can't open, but she could. What's this say? A report. Most exalted lady, as it was your will, we watched the streets all night. And not a sight of the villain Garrett had crossed our eyes. He walked here not, believe you us. In all, the picking was of no outstanding import. A beggar without a letter, an errant lamplighter crossing to Lampfire Hills, and a tramp who was caught trying to force one of the greats at the falls, but slipped and fell when we hailed him. That was a perplexing one, to have climbed up there without rope and hook. He was dead by the time the boys retrieved his frame, and he has been brought to the yard for your inspection. In any case, his form resembles Garrett not, and no distinct mark nor possessions has he. Trying to open one of the grates at the falls. Interesting. Hmm. Must be some loot up there. Letter from Jacobus Willen. Your ladyship, on account of your most illustrious patronage, we have attempted that which you asked of us. Queries placed with trustworthy clients in Lampfire Hills and Stone Market have granted us a lead, faint as it is. A young woman of great wealth and apparently aristocratic upbringing is behind the items you speak of. Elemental crystals, narcotic and stimulative substances, as well as curio beyond our usual sortiment, have been mentioned. Our further inquiries were frustrated, as our partners were probably afraid of disclosing a new source of merchandise. Nonetheless, we can confirm your suspicions, although if we might be so bold, we do not suggest a confrontation until further particulars become known. Respectfully, at your service, Jacobus Willen, Willen and Associates. Uh, oh, she's got a map of the old quarter of the city, and she's got a loot, and well, it's past ground ski, that's the key to the gate that I couldn't open. Anything on the bookshelf? I can't jump on it. Any secrets in the bookshelf? Is that? Oh, hmm. That does look a bit suspicious, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Well, how does it open? Hmm. Any book here that's not really a book, but secretly a switch or something of that nature? No. Anything on top? Maybe one of those is a switch. I don't know. Maybe there's a switch hidden elsewhere. A dark nook. It is a very suspicious looking book. So look, there's even a little crack around the edges. Oh, I can pick this up. Does this take me to a room full of healing potions? Please let it be so. I doubt it, though. Yes. Overly complicated lock. You're only protecting bits of a palace. There's nothing... Nothing essential in here, surely. Oh. Well, there is the scepter that we came for. And some skulls on top of another bookcase. Which also looks very suspicious. Well, there's that objective complete. We still need a bunch more loot. Um, and we have to go back to leave Dark Smoke the way we came. How much loot have we got, by the way? Total 1265, so we need another 400 or so. Uh, oh! Oh ho! It's all even suspicious. Where does this take me? 
have a gas hour, nice. Another key, the escape route key. Cryptic note. Confirmation of previous query. Definite breach of key rail tertiary. Dispersal of counter influences. Possible breach on Wainwright. Definite breach of various non operated depositories and thorough work all over. Obvious relation to case of T and supposed pagan conspiracy, but can be traced back to outside to G's activities. Suggested actions. Keep low profile and direct action for time being. Use decisive force through secondaries against G. Thereafter, common operation in lower locks may proceed to recovery of golden books and following diversionary action against unlawful elements. Verify through IW and avoid caches for time being. This must not fall into the wrong hands. Tanster. Yeah, keeping tabs on me. Even got a blackjack and lockpicks and compass. I've got my tools here. So, where did I get those from? Ooh. Oh, ho, ho. that's the escape route, is it? Interesting. Before I go up there, you know what I'm going to do? I'm sure this is another secret door. I'm going to investigate it a little more thoroughly. I've got this palace ground key now, so I can get out this door. I can uh, run around... This is the way. Collect those two crates. Let's grab grab the crates. Probably only need one, to be honest, but let's just grab both. Uh, and bring them up here. Unless you got any here, no. There's the corpse you friend they found. Da -da. It's a long way around, but uh, that's alright. There should be no one to bother us. Uh, unless I can actually go the quick way up with the crates, that actually might be doable. Might be worth trying. Back up here. No, nope. not nope. yeah. Thank you. Climb back up on the wall. Um, make a jump. Good jump, Garrett. Get up. Alright, one crate. Sleeping happily. Let's drop carefully, because we do not want to lose health here. Good. Take the second crate. I'll just carry one to the palace, but the other one's here if I need it, I guess. If the one is not sufficient. It's not like uh, in uh, that time in Bad Debts where I was carrying four crates back and forth and then uh, basically wasted them all through uh, carelessness and whatever. That was a bit un, uh, unprofessional. Alright, you go there. Can I see anything on the top here? Get on there. Why do those statues look like meerkats? Come on, get on the crate there. They do look like meerkats. Mere cats are not revealing to me any kind of secret switch. Maybe it's not a secret door? Maybe that's part of the escape route? I don't know. I guess I shall explore up this way and find out. Nope, this escape route is se entirely separate. Nice rose window. Um, hello? Oh. Hello? Where does this go? Oh, I know where this goes. I know exactly where this goes, right? No? Oh no. Oh, that might be the door that we couldn't, that, that we couldn't open. No, there's a fake door at, the, at that other place. Alright, it's overlooking... I don't know, I don't know this area at all. Oh, well, maybe this is overlooking. Uh, maybe that's the terrace where that society, the secret society people were. <laughs> can I climb up there? I can. <laughs> Just to check my theory here. Try not to fall down. Yeah, that's the secret society terrace. So the ladder that we climbed up there. Let us look down here. All right. 
Uh, that wasn't any particular point in being up here, but uh, good to know. Whoops. Alright. So this is going to fall a little further than I planned. Hmm. The bell tower. That was the society of the something in the bell, wasn't it? Ladder up or what? What do I have to climb now? By hand. Like a peasant or a thief. Where do I go from here, actually? Before I climb, I should have an idea where I'm trying to climb, shouldn't I? Oh, right at the top there, I guess. Alright. Right at the top we go. Hello, Bell. Oh, there's a ladder over there. Yeah, if I'd seen that, that would make it easier. Never mind. Who needs ladders when you have ropes? <laughs> What's this? A uh, bird has been collecting diamonds in its nest. Oh, I'll take those. That puts up to fifteen twenty. That's almost the total we need. However, this hasn't led to a way out anywhere. Said escape route. But uh, I'm not really escaping much at all up in this clock tower. Not even not even a way to just fall to my death on the outside the clock tower. It's all everything here is inside the clock tower. Unless there's another hidden door that I'm missing. There's nothing that has suggested a hidden door to me at all. All right, where's the ladder back down? Let's go back down. I don't. Whoop! Careful, Garrett. Careful. Okay. He doesn't. He doesn't like climbing those uh, ladders that are not very vertical. All right. Uh, so much for this escape route. I mean, it kind of gets you up here. It's not really very safe to get down from here unless. Oh ho! Oh, this is the escape route. All right. So I was just going to an optional secret area. Or I could get across there. Huh. If I go across here, can I get back? I think so. Let's try. Yeah, I should be able to get back here. Easily enough. This is probably just some loot. Flash bomb! Nice! <laughs> kind of running low on those. Oh, where does this take me? Oh, it's grated off. Oh, it's overlooking the inn, though. Alright. Um, so that doesn't get me anywhere. At least nowhere useful. Uh, that's not a door that opens, is it? It's barrels. Can I climb up this vine? I can. Doesn't take me anywhere useful. Oh, there's a golden harp. And that's valuable, and it's got my me to the treasure objective. That's nice. What? What are guards doing down there? I guess they're probably there all along. Help! I'm stuck. I'm I'm kind of stuck here. All right, that's better. You, dare me? I will regret this. Well, I'm not going to be here when your brothers arrive. How many brothers do you have, anyway? And how worried should I be? Alright. Here we are in another rich-looking place. So, our objective now, we have enough loot, is just to get back to... Darksmoke District. Which is in the northwest. And... I'm guessing... I don't know, where were we looking out over this street? Maybe? I don't know, where did the... I have no idea where we are. Is that a passageway up there? I wonder. That's not wood, is it? No. Is that you? Don't try to run, Tapper! Just surrender now! 
Uh, I'm gonna try and run, thanks. It works a lot better for me. This is your last chance. Step out here. I won't hurt you. Yeah. Where'd like, that tapper go? I've only got two hit points, you know. If you just look at me, I might die. Come back here and fight. The other one down there coming out as well. But I don't think I can get down there safely, so I do need to wait for this guy here to give up and go back. Or is he just going to end up patrolling in there? Well, I've got a flash bomb. I could use that if I need to. Okay, he's moving on. Um, I've got all these water arrows. I haven't used a single one. Let's just use one. If I do get caught in here again, it works a little easier. Quietly. Why not use two? Same reasoning. Go quietly, Garrett. You should have timed it when you open the door better so you're not to open it right in front of the guard. But I mean, you might patrol in here anyway, I don't know. I wasn't really waiting around to see what patrol routes were. Are you planning to come here? Yes, no. Oh, you are. Would you like a blackjack to the face? Oh, you would? Oh, that's a lovely coincidence because that's exactly what I had. I don't hear any other guards here, so I'm gonna be less cautious again. I've got a loot gold course, but that's not gonna stop me. There's a way out. There's oh, lots more loot. And a very unvaluable bottle. But also one that doesn't break easily. Now really, doesn't that look like those uh, hatches must open and you can hop over from place to place? But if it, if it is so, then I don't know how one would get that. Oh! More gargoyles. I don't like them because they're kind of awkward to jump from. It's alright, made it. I wonder is that a window that opens? Which way are we supposed to be going? North. Alright, let's check out the south first. Just briefly. Well, there's chains that go somewhere. That window doesn't open. Now, uh, that guard has got a sword or bow? I don't know. He's got a bow. Feels quite precarious. I'm hearing a guard in this window here as well. <coughs> Where's my flashbang? Better have it ready just in case. Flash bomb. Big round thing that goes flash. <laughs> so where are we now? I have no idea. Don't even know what part of the city we're in anymore, except it's still part of the, the city. Dark smoke district, obviously, but just up. Oh, wait, what? So, okay. I mean, I'm glad to be proven right about my surmise about the secret passages. I open now. But also, what is the purpose? Can I jump? Yes, yeah, so it is vaulted. Is this one? Did it go anywhere? Right? I could just drop down, but what else am I going to do? Oh, it had something valuable in his mouth. Okay. In fact, they all do. 
All right, all right, that makes sense now. This is why. Come on. Yeah, like I like it. I like it. That's a very nicely hidden loop. Um, very good. And also, if I hadn't found one of those before at the uh, other person's flat, the uh, what's the names? Beauregards. If I hadn't found their uh, talk, I guess is whoa, whoa, whoa! Careful, careful, careful. Be very careful. Uh, yeah, make noise. That's fine. Just be safe. All right. Uh, all right. Oh, and here's the market. So I do know where we are now. We are actually overlooking the border guards. So they must. That was the courthouse we broke into. All right. Okay. So we just need to head a little bit further north. Does that? Does this window open? No. How do I get down from here? Or is this just not a way down? Is this just a access just for that loot? Is there any wood? Can I see any wood? No, alright. Um. And what, is this another dead end? Oh, I'm confused now. I climbed up the ladder and got in here, but. I thought I was still trying to use an escape route. Um, I'm getting stuck in the window here. Don't fall. So if this is not a... Oh, I can climb over there, all right. So if there's not a viable escape route, then what is it? Oh, somebody's left a bars on a ledge over there. I wonder how you get that. I have no clue how we begin to get over there, unless maybe that window on the end is actually a window that you can get in. I'm going a little slowly because it's metal floor here and there's guards down there. I don't particularly want them to get them on my trail, but I may have to. Uh, I'm going to go clattering across this roof, aren't I? I guess I'm going to... Oh, it's not actually that bad. I thought I was going to slide. Oh! Bell tower. Oh, that's... No, that's not the same bell tower. This one's got big windows. Is that metal or wood? Metal. Alright. So I guess you can't rip way up there. Alright, well, we're getting closer. But I still don't have a good way down, do I? Hmm. I know... Did I ever read those signs? I don't think I did. Huh. How am I going to get down without killing myself here? Uh, there's your answer. If I get a rope at the right spot, it will... Well, that's not the right spot. That only comes down here. Yeah, when are they going to bring you your dinner and you'll stop grumbling about it? A little more like it. Oh, well. that was worth nothing. I don't see why I should have to be the one down here. Oh, the evil dark will fill me that to hold the light and get all the favors, and I don't have another thing to eat in days. You just carry on there with your grumbling. Let's hope this is not too. Let's hope this is not too far, I was saying. Alright. Uh, let's try the other way then. It's a little sneaky, but. Uh, <laughs> Show yourself! No! Okay, where did you all come from? All of a sudden. I want to read the notices before I go. Everybody's... All the guards are congregating. Oh, never mind. Never mind. If you play the mission yourself, you can find out what they say. Here we are, back at Trundle Street. Let's trundle our way homeward. And that should be a successful mission. Successful.
success. All right, uh, took us an hour and 45 minutes. That was uh, quite a lot shorter than expected, actually. We found, a, I guess if you're looking for all the loot, there's a lot more to find. Um, we we're just over half of it there. And uh, well, nothing marked as secrets, but there were clearly some very well hidden loot that we did find. Alright, well, that was disorientation. Uh, thank you very much for watching, and I will see you back here next time for whatever the next mission happens to be, and I don't know yet, uh, and I guess we'll find out.